If you love watching battle bots, then you'll love making this DIY inch bot made with the little bits, gizmos, and gadgets kit. Hey there, I'm Shannon Lanier. Hey there, I'm Madison Lanier, and today we are building a inch bot. That's right, it's gonna crawl along powered by or driven by a servo. Here's what you'll need. So first, we want to cut a 12 by 3 piece of this cardboard here, right? Now we're going to cut that out. So we have this, but to save time, we've already decorated our strips. How beautiful is that? The next step after we decorate is to fold these, okay? I'm going to show you. And this is the body of the inchworm, but we also have to make the feet, okay? So about two inches from the bottom, we're going to fold this back, okay? Step three. That's right, we're going to make a skeleton for the inch bot. So we're gonna take these skewers, we're gonna measure them on the inside. There we go. Okay, Madison, I'm going to make a line right here, and we're going to glue it right on to the body. Step number four. All right, and that means we need to secure this battery on the back leg. So now that the battery is secure, step number five, 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 five. five. We need to take this servo. Now this servo is sort of like a motor to make it go. So we're gonna cut a little window right above the battery for this servo arm to have room to spin. So now that we have the rectangle cut, we can mount the servo arm right there. Good job. What step are we on? Number six. All right, and that means we have to take a regular paper clip and we're going to straighten it out like this. And we're gonna use the paper clip to almost act as an accordion piece. But, all right, now that it's in there, we're going to make a little hook so it doesn't move, okay? All right, so now we wanna shove it through here. We have to make sure it's right across from that arm. So you see where that arm is? Okay, so now we wanna put the tape on the other side of the paper clip so it doesn't fall out. So now we have to connect the power switch onto the servo. Oh, look Can at I that. Try? So we'll plug the battery snap right into the power switch right there. Step number eight. We're gonna put these batteries here and that will give it some weight. Okay, Madison, now that everything is connected, we need to keep these wires out the way a little bit. And we're gonna tape them to the top. Decorate! Decorate! Decorate dance! Decorate dance! Loop it around the fingers. All right. Yeah. Now we're gonna make sure it stays by hot gluing it down to the face of this. Our face, maybe we should put some eyeballs on it. Yeah. Now that we've decorated our inch bot and our stage, are you ready to, not battle, wrestle? Yeah! The first inch bot to fall off the stage is the loser and the other, oh, you lost, I won. No. <laughs> Three, two, what? Go! Go! Mine's pushing yours. Oh! I don't know. Oh, no, 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 no! Stay away! Stay away! Burn, no. oh. Come on! Oh, don't Come on. Oh. Yeah. I'm always oh. So, Madison, what did you think of the inch bot? I loved it. What was your favorite part? Decorating. I know, it was so much fun and it looks so fancy, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. All right. So make sure you keep watching BattleBots on the Science Channel and check out fatherly.com for more DIY projects.